Man, what's up, y'all? Uh, welcome to my, not my first channel, but my new channel. If y'all don't know, I'm from Eastern Jersey. That's our, that's me and my brother's main account. This is like my second account, but it's more like on a personal level. You can see more of the personal side of me on this channel. It's, it's, it's what I call venting with Driz. So with Vincent with Driz, I'm gonna be like venting to y'all. Y'all might even get like a story time out of me. So it's gonna be pretty interesting. I just felt the need to make a channel like this so you guys can like get to know me on more of a personal level. Or like if you're just like interested in me or like, or if you just wanna see if you have anything in common with me. Alright. Alright, first thing I, first thing I want to say about myself is I've I can finally say that I found peace like within myself. Like as in eliminating like overthinking or being like overwhelmed in certain situations that I can't simply like control. It's like I'm at peace with it now. It's, it's like I know that what's the word for it? Um I know that everything worked out in the end because it's, it's always ended well. Every time a situation has occurred, I've always overcome it. So it's like, with me thinking like that, it's like, yeah, with, with me thinking like that, it's like, um, nothing's gonna happen again. Like, you're gonna overcome it again and again, and again, and again, and again. You just have to like stay positive and Stay uplifted and be confident within yourself. Most important, most importantly, be confident. And being confident is like something I struggle with for the longest, like for the longest, like the longest. And I can finally say that like I've I've reached a confident level. I feel like it's it, I feel like it's through like public interviews. Like if y'all don't know me, and my brother, we started doing public interviews like. Two months ago we actually started on his birthday which was in october and i say that's like the peak of my confidence for real for real i'm like because you just approach it random people you just ask them questions this that and it's like most of the time we just be stuck in our head like we be in our head for real for real like oh what are they thinking i don't want to say the wrong thing this that but doing public interviews really like help that situation like no one is really like judging you you're only judging yourself. No one's like really like paying attention to you besides yourself. So with that, it's just like, bro, just talk. Just do what you gotta do. Like there's no really there's really like no reason of overthinking for real. Just take action. And that's like that's like where I'm at right now. Mentally, physically, spiritually. I feel like I've I, I, I've become more aligned with myself. If y'all know I already had a spiritual awakening. But I feel like, I have, like I'm having like a, a second stage, if that makes sense. Cause I'm, like, I'm already awakened to stuff, but it's like I'm feeling things on a deeper level now, like times two. And I really love like where it's going, like where it's heading. Like I, I feel like I feel like next year, 2022 is gonna be crazy. Like I feel like it's gonna be crazy because it's like. I envision so many things like I have dreams too and y'all you guys are aware of what deja vu is and a lot of deja vu has been happening like recently 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 and like in my dreams certain things that I've accomplished happened in my dream so I'm like oh I remember this thing happened in my dream before this took off or that took off so I feel like having these deja vu moments is like a sign of letting me know that I'm on the right track and this close to accomplishing what I want and what I desire. But you know, it's like, at the end of the day, you just gotta be consistent. And it sounds so simple, it sounds so easy, but being consistent can be hard. Cause you know, we as humans go through emotions and sometimes you just don't feel like being consistent. You, you, you just don't feel like doing something over and over and over again if you feel a certain type of way. You know, you could be sick and or anything, 
but that's all that that's all I focus on is being consistent the, the more you guys see my face the more you guys get to know me on a more personal level I feel like you guys will gravitate more I forgot to introduce myself <laughs> all right well this channel name is venting with Driz uh, you can call me D you can call me Drizzy you can call me D Drizzy or you can call me Driz it don't matter it's up to y'all uh, welcome to the channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit the bell too so you guys will be notified when I drop uh, future videos you know in the near future which is like very soon all right I'm back some people walked by I had to stop the video all right so where was I um I want to get into like perspective like the way you see things and with like perspective <laughs> <laughs> like and with perspective it's like I I've had trouble dealing with perspective in a sense it's like something bad could happen like say you got you dropped your phone in the toilet <laughs> or something like that like just something that something good that, that, that something good that something good no all right let's just say something bad happened right and you're like bro why does it keep happening to me why is this happening like i don't understand this that yada 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 it's like in reality bro you have to see it from a different perspective you have to see it, like in a good perspective like say if like you dropped your say say if you cracked your phone or you lost your phone for like an hour or 30 minutes or something like that it could be for a good reason. It could be like you're on your phone for too long. You know, you're, you're on social media for way too long. You actually need a break. And that can just be a sign from God telling you that. Like, there's so many perspectives. So many perspectives. Like, if you just like eliminate your ego, which is pretty hard to eliminate your ego. But if you like suppress your ego and and put your soul first, like soul search first and all that, I feel like. You could find other perspectives that would be more fulfilling to the mind. Like, you could understand more. Because you're not just, like, looking from one perspective. You're looking from two or possibly even three. And I'm sure there's more perspectives, of course. But, like, that's just, like, an example right there of just, like, letting you know that if you think... Basically, eliminate your emotions in that situation and, and see it from a different see it from a different perspective, and that's what I've been doing. I'm like, yo, everything starts to make sense once once I start to do that. Just, just seeing things from different perspectives, and it's something I value, and it's something that I I try to stay track on. Like, I don't want to lose that. I don't want to lose track of who I am, and. I feel like I'm becoming more of the person I envision, the, the person that I want to be. I feel like I'm slowly becoming that person weekly, like closer and closer and closer and closer every day. Just because that's what I envision. And I'm taking action towards that. Not just, oh, I want to be that person. I want to be like that person and not do anything, just laying in bed, which I could do, but it's like, I'm not going to get anywhere. I'm not serving my purpose in any shape or form. So, with that, this is like a sign to you. Like, hey, man, just start taking action. If you want to do YouTube, you want to do something, you want to make music, anything. Sorry, the kids screaming in the back, if y'all hear them. <laughs> but, yeah, if you want to, like, be, do YouTube, make music, play sports, I really just say take action and study as well. Like, when I say study, it's like, you have people that, you have artists, you have people that love music. And you can study their music and see what inspires you. Or like sports, you can watch highlights and then try to Im imitate them and, you know, and then start taking action. And that could really go a far away, a really far away, actually. So, yeah, man. Um, I'm not going to keep y'all too long. I just wanted to drop my first video for you guys 
Well, you guys know this is a new channel that's gonna be consistent. You guys gonna be getting more videos from Vincent with Driz. And I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't be afraid to comment and vent as well. Tell how you feel, explain how you feel in the comments. This is a family thing. This is a safe place. I just wanna let you guys know that. And I love y'all. I'll see y'all soon.